We are near Woodland. We're in the Yolo Bypass. And today people gathered to discuss the fact that a field like this can help fish. The gathering today showcases an important project as well as a larger opportunity to reimagine a 21st century water system where their traditional floodplain is reconnected with the Sacramento River system in a safe and thoughtful way that provides uh, multiple benefits. The fields out here, the sloughs, the ponds, and this, this whole landscape are loaded with plankton. And what we see is during winter, a lot of that gets transported downstream where it can feed fish and the food web. But what we've tried to do here is try during the dry months to generate some flows that can help also transport um, food downstream to the fish when, when they wouldn't otherwise have access to the plankton. There's absolutely no magic bullet to fisheries conservation. The truth of the matter is there are many threats that have been at play for decades. But this activity is one important step that I'm hopeful with habitat restoration, with water quality improvements, with thoughtful habitat protections, we can actually recover these fisheries. So landowners are generally very supportive. They're wanting to see the fisheries improve because that's helped secure their water supply. So they're wanting to do everything they can short of really affecting their business enterprise, you know, being able to harvest their crop.